The NCAA Hall of Champions has made some awesome updates to their sports simulators. I'm going to head in and check them out. So the simulators that everyone's familiar with at the NCAA have now been updated. When did that happen? Uh, probably about a month and a half ago to two months ago. Uh, we got the, the brand new games, uh, new software that we use here. So it's been, it's been fun since we have. I mean, I come up here and play them every now and then myself. So I definitely love uh, the interaction with the game. So I love it. And what sports do you offer? Uh, we offer football, basketball, baseball, soccer, and also golf. Uh, so we, people can come up here and get a variety of chances to play different sports. Maybe that they play at home, or maybe that they don't get a chance to play at home, uh, or in school. And is there one that's more popular for kids? I would say right now, soccer is, is the best. Now, that may be because the World Cup just ended, uh, but I would say between soccer and basketball, the kids uh, love those two. And you mentioned to me earlier that you have private parties here, and that there's a game that's really popular with the adults. What is that? Uh, the adults, they love golf. Uh, whether it's, they get to use a driver inside here, or the regular, the regular iron clubs, uh, but yes, the, the competition heats up when it comes to golf. What noticeable updates have been made to these simulators? Uh, this, between the soccer, football, and basketball, uh, they all have brand new graphics. Uh, they're very comparable to what kids play like on their Xbox 360 and things like that. The player models look real, so it, it looks a lot different than what it did in the past, and it's, it's great. It's been great for the museum. And with some of these golf courses, is it true that they're actual courses that you could find around the country? Absolutely, yeah. The golf courses that we use, I, I can't think of the exact number of how many are on the system, but they are real golf courses that are used in the uh, PGA and LPGA tours. So. Anthony, the first sport I want to try is soccer. Would you show me how it's done? Sure, I'll give it a shot. Uh, soccer's not my best sport, but I'm definitely willing to try see if I can get a goal here. Good to me. That was pretty. That's good. so yeah. way more interactive than your typical museum's interaction. I mean, why Definitely. not be able to participate in the sports that they're championing there? Yeah, and I'm I'm not so great at sports um, with simulators or. On actual <laughs> You're not. I Come discovered on. I think my worst sport is baseball. At least pitching. I think I might be the second worst pitcher out there. Who's, of the, course, who's the worst? After Fifty Cent. Oh, yeah. oh, but you know, oh, yeah. that, that, that was my soccer wasn't horrible, but pitching was well, because it's I with the legs, right? right? You're, you're used to kicking. Yeah, you're soccer. My legs, my legs are good, it. but like, and it's a pretty yeah. big space you have to throw the ball into, and <laughs> it was still. pretty funny. No, uh, Amy, our shooter, was with me, and I threw the ball big square right there and hit the floor <laughs> in front of the screen. <laughs> the second time, hit the top corner. Is she so, laughing at you? And yes. If yes, you're gonna do that, better to do that at a museum than in a stadium. Yes. Right. All right. Definitely. If you yeah. get to throw out the first pitch at, a, at an Indians game, you go to the Hall of Champions first. Go warm up practice. there. Yeah. Yeah. That's exactly. right. You might a have a shot there. Good stuff. Good workout, Maybe too. Yeah. So check it out. All right. yeah. Follow her on social media because I can't keep up with her in real life. That's the only way I can possibly know what she's up to. <laughs> keep busy. There you go. Busy. There you go. All right. Loosen up that pitching arm. We'll be right back. <laughs>